Hi there guys, tonight on the table, Poulang Cobra Compact Compound Slingshot Bow. Beautiful piece of kit. Quad limb compound, 45 pound draw, adjustable. Can be wound back to 30 pounds by the adjustment screws, four of which. Fiber optic sighting system. So we can get uh, get on the camera. Mm -hmm. Where are you at? Just about to get on the camera. Illuminating the can get right in. So we can get yeah on off. Able brightness. Great sight picture. Right then, let's talk you through the bows. Let's let's start at the front. At the front, fiber optic sighting system. Uh, one, two, three, four, five veins, illuminated for your different trajectories. With a variable potentiometer, using three watch batteries for your lights. All alloy construction, alloy, no plastic. As you know, I hate plastic. So, all alloy head. Alloy riser. It's a seven and a half inch riser with quad limbs, multi-adjustable, four pins, voila, here's the one I prepared earlier. The handle is quite comfortable, it's not the most comfortable, it's quite comfortable. If you've got a small hand, because most of these bows are designed with Chinese in mind, so medium sized shooters um, are going to have a great comfortable fit. If you've got a hand like a gorilla, you're going to have difficulty squeezing your hand in. You're going to have to make a custom grip. There is no alternative grip for it. Custom is the only route to get your jigsaw out in a lump oak. Whisker biscuit on the rear instead of at the front. The whisker biscuit alloy mounted. Four string setup. You release. Peep sight set into the, um, the main drawstring and pulled off against cam string. I haven't got my trigger with me, so I'll demonstrate without. I'm sure. So pull back. As you can see now, the sight, peep sight is lined up directly with my right eye. And you've got your uh, sighting system there. So 45, 45 pound draw, seated position, so you'll be sat in, sat in your home, door defence, somebody comes in, great, so, so down, is that I find easiest, draw, bring it up, on target, release. Can be used for archery or steel ball. How is it done? I'll show you. First of all, remove your whisker biscuit and make sure that's out of the way, just for safety reasons, when you first use your seal bearing. Into your drawstring sits a cradle with a magnet. I haven't got the hand at the moment, I'll do another video for ball bearing shooting. So where you would normally sit your string, your, your knock into your string, it just clips over. Um, and you sit the magnet into your string. You then use your trigger to pull back on the release and release. And that fires the ball bearing straight down through your channel through the front. This is why I recommend removing your sight. Because if you, if you, you, when you first use it in your practice, you get it wrong, you'll smash your sight out. Cost. I've seen from £150 on eBay without accessories up to £200 with your ball bearing release, sighting system, whisker biscuit, um, doesn't come with a trigger, triggers your own choice with a thumb release, finger release, that's down to you. Comes in black or woodland camel, um, I went for the woodland camel, I wish I'd gone um, tactical black, but it don't matter, I can always paint it. Cam wheels, either standard MK350 cam wheels, um, and, ca and cable set. 
Beautiful construction. I put about a hundred um, shots through this now. Um, this will be our look at the detail now of the cam wheels. Grab the camera. Okay. Then you see my cam wheels are well waxed. Plenty of bolstering wax. Make sure everything. Always make sure your string is waxed. If you're not waxing your string, you get friction. So there we are. The Polang um, triangle compact um, compound um, pistol bow, slingshot bow. They, they, I haven't found a designated name on it, um, but I will include the, the links in the description below as always. The limbs are interchangeable, and so you can get sixty pound up, upgrade limbs as well. Um, for a, a close range compact, I think. It's, it's good enough. So give you a size of give you, give you the size of the brace from my hip to my shoulder. Is a great little thing. It's got the forty five pound limbs on it. Um, I think sixty pounds is is is. is is for my opinion for close range work is too much for close range hunting 45 pounds is perfect um 60 pounds if you want want to push up your ranges a little bit and go for, for bigger targets cheers guys keep watching